Hey everyone! So, um, I've just seen the new update for Stellaris and it took me a few minutes to actually work out how sectors are now working. Um, it's actually um, quite simple though, I did have to look at um, a website to figure it out. So, if you um, notice, these planets have got blue around them. So, this is now a sector capital, okay? And everything within three stars is connected to the sector so for example one two three so these two are connected to the um are connected to the sector so the sector capital is yomon three okay um which is this planet here now if we look at this because it's within three this will be the new this will be the sector capital two so um, the rest of it works like normal, so if I click on this for example I can go here and I can um, assign leaders the same as um, same as always. And yeah, um, the, inter the interface has changed, but um, yeah, it's, it's basically um, kind of similar. So um, yeah, you can transfer resources before, um, like before, if you hold um, control then you um, obviously transfer a thousand at a time, um, which is pretty cool. So also, um, oh sorry, I don't need to actually recruit. We've got loads of um, nice. So um, yeah, let's make one from scratch. So I'm gonna choose a sector I own. So for example, um, the soul sector, because that's kind of where we live. So. I'm going to click Planet and Sector up here. No, sorry. I'm going to go back to the Soul Sector. I'm going to click this button here. Um, sorry. <laughs> Poor one. Okay. Um, create new sector. So I'm going to click on Create new sector. And then, as you can see, we can assign the governor for the sector. Um, you notice the little blue highlight around the sector. Um, now, of course, if you want to um, look at the soul sector, you obviously you can um, change this like you could before. Just for example, I'm not really too fast, but uh, yeah, the other thing you can do is you can put the um, planet automation on or off. So I'm going to turn planet automation on. And then you can leave this and it will automatically select one for you. Or else you can select, for, for example, Urban World, Mining World, Agri World, whatever kind of world specialty you want, you can just choose it here and it will automatically manage that for you. So I don't have the um, newest update, but you know, this is fairly standard and it was a bit tricky, so I just thought I'd make this video. So I hope you found it useful. Thank you very much.